welcome to the Storybox Project. My name is Fern and this is our Halloween theme. This activity is our Witch's Potion activity. In this activity we're going to channel our inner witches as seen in William Shakespeare's play Macbeth. Now the first thing we need to do in the play Macbeth there is a rhyming couplet that you will hear the witches say over and over again before they put all of their quite disgusting ingredients into the cauldron. So we're just going to learn that rhyming couplet now. So it goes like this. Double, double, toil and trouble. Fire, burn and cauldron, bubble. Now, don't worry if you can't get all of those words because it's quite tricky and it's quite wordy, but just try your best. We're going to say it lots of times, so you'll, you might be able to, to remember it and to say it just as we get towards the end. So I'm going to say it again. Double, double, toil and trouble. Fire, burn and cauldron, bubble. Let's try it one more time, but this time I'm going to try it with um, a little bit of a witch's voice and then you can join in with me with a witch's cackle at the end. Let's see if we can try it together. Double, double, toil and trouble. Fire, burn and cauldron, bubble. And then should we try a witch's cackle together? <laughs> Perfect. Okay, so the first ingredient that we need to put into the potion is a toad. So let's think of an action we could do for toad. Maybe something like, maybe a jump, we could have some frogs, uh, toad's legs, and we could kind of go, grab it. Should we try that together? Let's try it. Ribbit! Okay, let's put that toad into our cauldron. It's our cauldron down there. Okay, so let's try it again with our couplet at the beginning and then we'll put our toad into the potion. So here we go, double, double. Double, double, toil and trouble. Caught fire burn and cauldron bubble. And then let's get our toad. Ribbit and put our toad in. Okay. Number two in our cauldron goes a fillet of fenny snake. So I think what Shakespeare meant by that was any snake that lives in the fen, a fillet of that snake. So we're going to put a fillet of fenny snake into our potion. So maybe we could do this for a snake. So let's add our snake into the mixture, into our potion now. Snake. So we have a toad, ribbit, and we have a snake, a fillet of fenny snake. And we'll add them both to our cauldron, to our potion. Okay. Uh, what is next? We have, oh, this one's not too pleasant. We have an eye of newt, an eye of newt. So maybe we could just point at our eye for that one and then pop it into the cauldron. So we have an eye of newt. Ugh, very disgusting. Let's see if we can go from the beginning of the sequence and we'll try our couplet at the beginning as well. So we'll try from double, double. Here we go. Double, double, toil and trouble. Fire, burn and cauldron, bubble. A little cackle maybe? <laughs> okay, into the cauldron goes. A toad, ribbit. Put that in there. A fillet of fenny snake. Put that one in there. 
Also, I of newt. Okay. Number four is wool of bat. Now, I can only assume that Shakespeare means the fur of a bat. So what can we do for bats? Maybe fly our wings. So we could fly our bat wings and then put the bat into the witch's cauldron. Okay. And our final ingredient that we're going to put in is, it's not a very nice one, it's tongue of dog. Tongue of dog. So we can maybe just stick our tongue out for that one. And put it into the cauldron. So let's just go from the bat. So we've got the wool of bat. Put that in the cauldron. And we've got tongue of dog. Very disgusting ingredients from William Shakespeare here. Okay. So let's see if we can do them all from the beginning together, from double, double, and then we'll add all of our ingredients into the cauldron and maybe give it a, give it a mix up, give it a stir. So in our best witches voices, double, double, toil and trouble, fire burn and cauldron bubble. Okay, ingredient number one is a toad. Ribbit. Put that in. Number two is. Oh, I forgot something. Number two is. Oh, I remember. Fillet of Fenny Snake. So we'll do this. Put that in. Number three. Of newt. Number four, this is wool of bat. Right. And our final ingredient, tongue of dog. And then let's give our cauldron a stir. And let's hear our witch's cackle. Okay, let's maybe just try it one more time and let's make our ingredients bigger, the actions bigger and louder and even spookier and creepier than what we did just before. So let's try it one more time from Double Double Toil and Trouble. Here we go. Double Double Toil and trouble, fire burn and cauldron bubble. <laughs> Into the potion goes a toad, rabbit, a fillet of fenny snake, an eye of newt. Also got number four, wool of bat. Number five, tongue of dog. Give it a stir. Let's hear our witch's cackles. and very creepy indeed. Thank you for joining this activity with me. I hope you enjoyed it. If you're looking for any more scary Halloween activities, then feel free to have a look at the playlist just below. Also be sure to subscribe to our channel, The Storybox Project, by pressing the red button so you can be the first to know when we upload any new material or activities. Thank you for joining in and I hope to see you soon. Bye for now.